If you're over 40, you've got it. Cognitive decline. Sad to tell you, uh, Manu, Singh Manu in the British Medical Journal in 2000, 2012 published an article entitled The Timing of Onset of Cognitive Decline. It's a longer title, but that's the short version. And found, looking at government workers, they did a longitudinal study, followed people in a cohort that were 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, all the way up, and they, found, and they were looking at cognitive decline. What they expected to find is that people would decline and function in their 70s and 80s. They found that, and they found that that was the greatest decline. But what they also found is people in their 40s declined in function in, the, in that particular decade. So this was so eye-opening and, and a little scary. So what they offered, which I really liked, um, all areas declined except, and let me give you one, vocabulary. You know, people tend to continue to grow in their vocabulary. I think it's something that we work at. So that was the ramification of the article. They said, you know, we really need to work at our challenges to our cognition. So, for example, if you exercise and you run, don't run the same route every day. Change it up. Make your body think about it. Make your mind. And, and basically what they said is whatever is good for the body is good for the mind. Uh, don't drive your car the same way every day. Take a different route so your mind has to be challenged. Just like you challenge your muscles and bones and heart, challenge your brain. So good research, use it not only for your patients but for yourself.